Stupid. Ridiculous. Absurd. Boring. No, you guys, physics is great. Prove it. Yeah. Prove it. I don't need to prove it. Physics proves itself. If you don't show us that physics is good, then we won't be your friend anymore! And we're gonna leave! Yeah! But then who will help you study for the test? I don't care about physics anymore. Me neither! Here, I'll show you how great physics is! A shopping cart with a high velocity. You can try, but you feel the impact from your chest down to your knees. But I can tell you how to slow it down. All you have to do is say please. Cause the work is simple now. Here's how you increase the view with the rocks on the ground. I was lost till I took physics from with Sister K. Now I don't miss a beat ever since the first class began. Friction was TV for Delta T times 10 But it's FFR equals mu FN of which I'm a fan today And why don't miss a beat? For Delta T, all I have is my VFC. I've tried to work it in somehow, but the stress just gets to me. Don't you worry, Becky. You just forgot your gravity. Cause when things are launched from ground to ground, the projectile really gets around to VF, make it negative, and then divide by A. That's half of Delta T. All you do is multiply by two. Cause if you don't, then you just end up with your Delta T. So finish up this final question, you've got a project that's due. Okay. I'll solve for Delta T. I have a little problem I'd like you to solve, if you don't mind. I can't find my momentum, I don't have an initial V. I started in the morning, and now it's half past three. But there's another part of the question, conservation of energy. Cause when you're at the top and you're high up there, MGH will be half of your MV squared. Your VF in this case will carry on to your part two. VF is V, I know. Your initial V and mass will be the same as the other side. The total mass and times your V. Assuming you stick to the girl and rest she doesn't see you see. My VF is V, I know. Which I'm a fan today. Now I don't miss 
so be 